2019학년도 11월 고등학교 1학년 전국연합학력평가 3교시 영어 영역 듣기평가 방송을 시작하겠습니다. 1번 대화를 듣고 남자의 마지막 말에 대한 여자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Mom, look! It's raining outside, but we don't have umbrellas. I think we need to buy one in this building. Okay. Where can we buy one? 2번. 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Mr. Smith, can you give me advice on how to edit my essay? Sure. First, take a look at the handout I gave you last class. It has helpful examples. Really? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm afraid I lost it. 3번. 다음을 듣고 남자가 하는 말의 목적으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our show, Secrets to a Healthy Life. I'm your host and health expert, Eric Bolton. You might have heard that many people suffer from dry skin as the weather gets colder. Let me share some tips to keep your skin healthy in the winter. When you take a bath, use water that is not very hot. A long, hot bath in cold weather can make your skin dry and eventually cause skin trouble. And one more tip for your skin in the winter. Put lotion or oil on your skin as often as possible. I hope you can make use of these tips to keep your skin healthy even in the winter. 4번. 대화를 듣고 여자의 의견으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Hello, Jake. Is studying for the final exams going well? Not really, Miss Baker. I've been drinking energy drinks to stay awake. Well, I think you'd better not drink too many of them. Why? Do they have harmful effects? Energy drinks have a lot of caffeine. So drinking them too much can disturb your sleep and make you feel dizzy. That explains why I can't sleep well at night. Right. Also, drinking them can make you nervous. Really? I thought it would relieve my stress instead. That's not true. And the more you drink energy drinks, the more you become dependent on them. Do you mean I can become addicted to them? That's right. So, you should be careful not to drink too many of them. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Thanks, Miss Baker. 5번. 대화를 듣고 두 사람의 관계를 가장 잘 나타낸 것을 고르시오. Hello. How can I help you? Hi. I made an online reservation. Do I get the tickets here? You don't have to get tickets if you have a reservation number. Just show it at the entrance and you can enjoy the whole camping expo. That's great. I heard there is a section for camping tables and chairs in the expo. Where can I find it? When you go inside, you'll see it on your right. Look for camping goods on display. Thanks. Is there a cafeteria around here? Yes, we have one on the second floor. Thank you so much for your help. My pleasure. Enjoy your time in our camping expo. 
6번 대화를 듣고 그림에서 대화의 내용과 일치하지 않는 것을 고르시오. What are you looking at, honey? It's the picture Sally sent to me. She recommended that we go to the new community park near her house. Let me see it. I like this big round table on the left. We can have some sandwiches and talk there. Sounds great. Look at the elephant face at the top of the slide. It looks cute. Yeah, there are also swings next to it. Our son would like this park, too. He sure would. Oh, there is a seesaw in front of the swings. Wow, this park has everything a child could want. It's great to find a place where parents and children can have a good time together. It really is. Take a look at these flowers placed in the shape of a heart. They're beautiful. How about going there this weekend? Terrific. I can't wait to go there. 7번. 대화를 듣고 남자가 여자에게 부탁한 일로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. David, how are the preparations going for your meeting tomorrow? Hi, Jennifer. They're almost done. I'm about to check if everything is ready. Sounds good. Since I finished my own work today, I can help you. That's very kind of you. I confirmed the reservation for the meeting room and sent text messages informing the participants of tomorrow's schedule. What about snacks for the meeting? They're in my car. I'll get them tomorrow morning. And is there anything else left to do? Let me see. I need to make name tags to give to the participants. Do you want me to help you with that? No, thanks. I can handle it. Could you print out some materials for the meeting instead? Sure. I'll do that for you. I'll send you the file to print out right now. Thank you. 8번. 대화를 듣고 여자가 가족 여행을 갈수 없는 이유를 고르시오. Hello, Janice. What's up? Hi, Chris. How are you spending your vacation? I've been doing a lot of cooking. How about you? You said you're going on a family trip. Yeah, I was supposed to, but I can't. Really? Aren't there flight tickets available? Well, it's not about tickets. Then why? Oh, is there still a problem with your ankle? No, I'm okay now. Actually, I applied for an overseas volunteering program earlier, and I was accepted. What a great chance. So you can't go on that family trip. You're right. I'll be abroad for a month. I wanted to say goodbye to you before I leave. Take good care of yourself. I'm sure you'll have a meaningful experience. Thank you for supporting me. Have a nice vacation. 9번. 대화를 듣고 남자가 지불할 금액을 고르시오. Welcome to Good Aroma Candle. How may I help you? Hi, I'm looking for scented candles for my parents. They like flower scents. Come over here and try this flower scent. Thanks. I like this rose-scented candle. How much is it? Large candles and medium ones are on sale now. Large ones are $20 and medium ones are $10 each. Well then, I'll take two large candles. If you buy any three candles, we give you a soap for free. Great. Then I'll have a medium one with the same scent as well. Did you say they're $10? Exactly. You're getting two large candles and one medium candle. 
That's right. Can I also use this mobile coupon? Of course. You get 10% off the total price with that. Thank you. I'll pay by credit card. Ship Bun. Tewa Red Go. Junior Bedimintan Competition Egwane. Ongut Digi Anunga Sukorushio. Kelly, did you see this Junior Badminton Competition leaflet? No, not yet. Let me see. The competition is on November 21st at 10 a.m. It's after the midterm exams. Why don't we sign up for the competition as a team? Sounds exciting. It would be an unforgettable event before graduating. Exactly. The participation fee is only $8. That's reasonable. Oh, look at this. They provide lunch for free. But here it says we have to bring our own rackets. Then we should bring ours. How can we apply for the competition? It says we can sign up online. Let's do it together now. Okay. I'm really looking forward to it. Dream Children's Library e Guanan Taum Neung Dikko Ilchiaji An Ningos Gorushio. Hello, listeners. I'm happy to introduce you to the first children's library in our town. It's the Dream Children's Library. Our library is for children in the sixth grade and younger. We have a variety of toys as well as books for different ages of children. There are special reading discussion programs for your children. Also, we offer movie showings for children every weekend. We're excited to tell you our library is now ready to open. Our opening day is November 24th. On opening day, we'll provide cartoon character bookmarks to all the visitors. Don't miss it. For more information, visit our website. www.dreamchildrenslibrary.org 12번 다음 표를 보면서 대화를 듣고 여자가 선택할 미술용품 세트를 고르시오. Hey, Kathy. What are you looking at? Hi, Steve. I was searching for an art supply set. I'm thinking about sending it as a Christmas gift to children in need. You're so kind. Do you need help choosing one? Yeah, thank you. I want it to be under $20. All right. Let me see. Which type of coloring tool would be good for them? Hmm. I think watercolors are not very convenient. The kids would need extra things like brushes. I agree. The other tools would be better. Right. How about the number of colors? They'll need more than 30 colors to express what they want. You're right. Then there are two choices left. Yeah. Oh, there is a model which includes a sketchbook. Perfect. They might need it in their art classes. I'll choose that one. 13번 대화를 듣고 여자의 마지막 말에 대한 남자의 응답으로 가장 적절한 것을 고르시오. Brian You look so tired today. Yeah, even though I get enough rest, I feel exhausted these days. Hmm, maybe you need some exercise. You like swimming, don't you? I do, but I often feel lazy. That's true for me, too. 
So I made myself join a sports club at school. What kind of sports club? I exercise in a yoga club. I find it very helpful to work out with other people at a fixed time. I guess exercising with others can help you keep motivated. Exactly. Why don't you join a sports club too? Actually, I'm interested in the swimming club, but as far as I know, the registration period ended. It's too early to give up. I saw a notice that all the clubs extended their registration period to this Friday. Shipsabon. Tewaril Dikko. Namjaye Majmang Maridean Yojaye Ungdaburo. Kajang Tokjoran Gosil Kodushio. Bonnie, what are you doing? I'm checking my bank account. I'm running out of money again. Haven't you gotten paid for your part time job yet? I have, but I already spent most of the money hanging out with my friends. At the end of month, I'll be broke. Then, how about setting a weekly budget? A weekly budget? What do you mean by that? I usually set a budget for each week and don't spend more than it allows. So I've cut down on everyday spending on chips and soda. Good for you. Can I save money if I make it a habit too? Of course you can. If you consider your budget, you'll think twice before you spend money. That makes sense. Keeping a weekly budget seems advantageous. Now that I keep a weekly budget, I spend money only where I need it. I bet it'll work for you, too. Shibobon, Taum Sangang Samyong El Dikko, Tedga Linda Ege Halmalo, Kajang Chokjaran Gosil Korushio. Ted and Linda are classmates. Linda has some trouble with her friends because she often forgets her appointments with them. In contrast, Ted is always on time, and the other classmates think he's very responsible and reliable. Today, Linda even forgets to submit an important paper. She knows what she has to do, but it's not easy for her to remember everything. Disappointed in herself, she asks Ted for some help on how she can overcome her habit of forgetting. He thinks using a calendar app could help break her bad habit. So Ted wants to advise Linda to try using a calendar app. To remind her of important things. In this situation, what would Ted most likely say to Linda? Hello, students. Last class, we learned about recycling. Today, I'll introduce you to something better than recycling. It's the process of turning waste into new items in a creative way. Let me show you some examples. First, one creative way is to make plastic bottles into vases for your home. Second, you can turn old cardboard boxes into fun chairs. All you need is just a little time and some paint. Third, an easy way to use empty cans creatively is turning them into fancy pencil holders for your desk. Lastly, when old newspapers pile up in your home, You can use them to wrap any present. It'll make your gift unique and memorable. In this way, you can create something new out of waste on your own. 
There are an endless number of ideas you can come up with if you use your imagination. Let's do something wonderful for our planet by this process: upcycling. 다시 한번 듣겠습니다. Hello, students. Last class, we learned about recycling. Today, I'll introduce you to something better than recycling. It's the process of turning waste into new items in a creative way. Let me show you some examples. First, one creative way is to make plastic bottles into vases for your home. Second, you can turn old cardboard boxes into fun chairs. All you need is just a little time and some paint. Third, an easy way to use empty cans creatively is turning them into fancy pencil holders for your desk. Lastly, when old newspapers pile up in your home, you can use them to wrap any present. It'll make your gift unique and memorable. In this way, you can create something new out of waste on your own. There are an endless number of ideas you can come up with if you use your imagination. Let's do something wonderful for our planet by this process: upcycling. 십육 번 여자가 하는 말의 주제로 가장 적절한 것은 십칠 번 언급된 물건이 아닌 것은 이제 듣기 문제가 끝났습니다.